<laughs> Shall we commence? You've improved quite a bit, but you still haven't become a true fighter. The real training starts now. Behind you! I couldn't see you! You were moving too fast! Your eyes will lie! Try to feel it! But I, I did feel it! That's the problem! From now on, whenever you're not eating or sleeping, you're fighting with me. No, no way! I'll die for sure! Then get stronger! Stronger than me! And stronger than the Saiyans will be here in six months. It's over! It's over! Well, it seemed that the last six months have wrung the crybaby out of you, at least. <laughs> yeah, but my dad used to tell me, he said, ever since you were reborn, you're not nearly as bad as you used to be. He said, now you're more grumpy than evil. <laughs> I don't know, I think he was kind of right. But, I mean, my mom is still totally scared of you and all. Stop blabbering and go to sleep. 
If you think today's training was hard, wait till you get a load of what I got in store for you tomorrow! Um, yes, sir. Impudent little brat. I don't know if it's Kakarot, but something is on the way. And whatever it is, its power level exceeds 5,000. Nappa! Enough! Playtime is over! Eliminate them, now! We can't risk having all four team up on us! No! Piccolo! Let me! You just get out of there! And I'll find a way to keep this guy busy while we wait for Dad! <laughs> now what kind of nonsense is that? Do you expect me to let you go head to head with this oaf all on your own? Keep me busy, huh? <laughs> if that's what the brat wants, let's go! Damn it! <laughs> what? You're through! Die! 
Gohan, you're the only person I've ever known who didn't treat me like a monster. Piccolo, no! Just hold on! Please don't die! <clears throat> thank, thank you, Gohan. If I'd known that merging with another being could result in this kind of power, I'd have sought it out years ago. It's Piccolo! Sorry to keep you waiting. So that's Frieza. I see. He's even more hideous than I imagined. Yet another Namekian who escaped my attention. This one is far more imposing than the others. No matter, he will soon join the rest of his kind in oblivion. <laughs> In honor, you will be the first ones to ever lay eyes upon me in this next state. Prepare yourself and behold! What do you think was it worth the wait? Now, if you're ready, let's begin round two, shall we? Special Beam Cannon! Don't 
you mock me? Damn it! I'm in real trouble now! What happened to all that energy you had a moment ago? Is that tiny reservoir of strength all dried up now? I can't take this anymore! Dad needs our help! I'm going in! Wait a minute! I think he's got something up his sleeve! A spirit bomb! Huh? A spirit bomb. Is that what I think it is? I've never seen a mass of energy that size. Frieza's wise to Goku's ploy. You two, listen up. Whatever happens, I forbid you to interfere in any way. Farewell. Hurry, finish that spirit bomb before he comes back. Thanks, Piccolo. How is that Namekian still drawing breath? I thought they'd all been taken care of! I hate to rush you, but something tells me Breeze is losing his patience. Hurry, launch it now! No! Not yet! Just a little bit longer! I'm beset on all sides by sneaking parasitic flies! This is more than I can stand! <laughs> Nice. With what little they had left, they put it to good use. Okay, it's finally ready. Do it! What have you done? This is child's play. No beastly tricks them, you dial. Let's not waste any time.
So these are the fearsome androids, huh? Not quite the monsters I'd imagined. Go on, you see it too, right? Yeah, right. It seems his technique has rushed for some reason. Fights just started and Goku's wasting most of his power. That and his technique is sloppy. That's it. I'm stepping in! Mr. Piccolo? Piccolo! That's enough! Fall back, Goku! This enemy's mine! Do you actually think you can defeat us? Don't believe me? The results of my last three years of training are about to show you! It's over! Over here! Sure. Do not bother, it is futile! It's over! This will stop you! Explosive demon wave! Over here! Sure. It's over! Stand aside! I'll trash these worthless puppets! Vegeta! Android 20 got away. Hey, Goku! What's your condition? Seems like the heart virus hasn't kicked in as we were expecting. Yeah, but... I can feel it setting in, for sure. It was stupid of you not to bring the medicine in case this happened. At the very least, you should rest yourself. I'll swing by your place to pick up that medicine. In the meantime, why don't you head for Master Roshi's place and take it easy, okay, Goku? Thanks, Yamcha. And sorry for all the trouble. 
We'll keep up the pursuit of Android 20. Well, as much as I hate following Giraud's orders, the idea of us standing around here doing nothing all day is driving me up the wall. I'll handle this. Come on. Just so you know, I won't be holding back. They're strong, but I can take them. If I had to choose between going into battle alongside the Namekian, the Earthlings, or Kakarot, I'd fight and die alone before accepting help from them! Beautiful speech. You know what? I would have gotten bored just watching anyway, so I'll jump in and we'll have a nice little two-on-two. -two. Have it your way. All right, looks like I'm fighting you. I better watch myself. It's over! You're kidding! Over here! Huh? Better than I thought. These androids show no sign of exhaustion at all. Gohan's hidden potential is starting to come to the surface. If we combine our strength, we'd be a force to be reckoned with. The virus is getting worse, isn't it? Yeah. But I can only take the medicine once it's completely infected me. Till I beat this thing, I'm not gonna be all that useful in combat. They're way stronger than we thought. Three years training wasn't enough. So the only way we're gonna stand a chance now is to train some more. Piccolo, I had wanted to train with Gohan in the hyperbolic time chamber, but would you go and train with him in my place? He has so much potential. I know you could bring out his latent power. But, but 
Dad, you're sure I have a power like that within me? Go on. Listen to me. I know you do. And I know you can feel it. You've already gotten so strong with your training as it is. Think of how much further you could go. <laughs> the hyperbolic time chamber, huh? All right, sounds like a good plan. But this training won't be exclusively for Gohan's benefit. I want to make sure that I too could keep holding my own in this battle. Mr. Piccolo, that sounds great. I'll work really hard. <laughs> 17 and 18. I found you at last. Ready to be absorbed. <laughs> <laughs> what do you think? Absorbing that android made him stronger. Go on. We need to buy some more time. Okay. Understood. longer we can last. Wait. This energy. Hey, go on. Go on. I'll fight too. We have all the food and drink we need. It's the perfect environment to focus on training. So what kind of training are we going to be doing? More than anything, we need you to be able to become a Super Saiyan like your father. Then you need to go further beyond even that. But first, I'll be focusing on sharpening the parts of your skill set that are still a bit rough around the edges. Got it? Where should we start? You have latent power that surpasses even Goku's strength. But you need to control your emotions so you can wield that power. 
In this fight, I'm gonna push you to your limit. You need to keep yourself grounded and maintain your anger. Now come on! Control my emotions. Okay, I'll give it a try. I get that you don't have a passion for fighting, and that's all well and good. But your pacifism won't mean squat if the world gets destroyed. Now come on. Contain your anger, your fear, your anxiety. Then let them all explode. I'll try my best. Hope you're at peace. Be gone. Hope you're at peace. Be gone. Working on it. And don't forget that feeling. So, who will be going up against me first? Will it be Goku? Ooh, or perhaps Vegeta? I know damn well how powerful Cell has become in his perfect form, even before the fight's begun. But this is what I've trained for. Cell, I am prepared to be your first opponent. What? Mr. Piccolo, are you sure? Final Piccolo. He's got a plan in mind. So I say we let him do his thing! I'll give it all I've got. Even if there's only the slightest chance of winning. My, my. This is a delightful surprise. Piccolo! But I'm in a gracious mood, so I'll allow you to show me your progress. Good. The training I've endured all this time has been for the sole purpose of taking you down. So let's go! So go on then, show me everything you can do! Hope you're at peace! Be gone! Light grenade! Goodness! The surprises just keep on coming! You're definitely strong, but fight with everything you've got! Head over here! Forget it! It's over! Interesting. Your improvements are actually quite remarkable. Unfortunately, there's still not enough to surpass mine. 
Hope you're at peace. Be gone. <clears throat> Don't get too relaxed. Oh, okay. I'll start taking this seriously then. Come on! I thought you were ready to fight me! Or are you just ready to surrender? <laughs> he's... he's gonna kill Mr. Piccolo! Stop it! Stop! Now that's some energy! Fantastic! I do believe my next opponent has already been decided. We're not done! <laughs> Actually, we are. Want me to end it already? <laughs> I'm not letting him off that easy. He deserves to feel the same pain he put all his victims through. Go on! <sighs> I'm calm, Mr. Piccolo. For a moment there, I was completely blinded with rage. When I thought about my training with you, I came back to my senses. Good. You've learned much. Cell, you wanted to become the ultimate life form, right? Well, you can't beat me now, so you should give up. So one more time, I ask that you surrender. What's wrong? Where did all that confidence disappear to? No, he's become more powerful than ever. <laughs> now it's my turn to torture you before I kill you. <laughs> I, I won't let you! Oh, for the love of... Have you still not realized that I'm done with you? Stand aside or die! I told you I wasn't done. This is still my fight, too. Go on. I'll buy you some time. Rest until you're ready to finish him. <sighs> right! Right! <laughs> 
sure. buying some time, are you? <laughs> How much? Maybe a few measly seconds? Hope you're at peace. Be gone. <laughs> you won't survive this time. <laughs> Light grenade! Let's go! You won't be able to outrun me. Damn it! You're less than dirt! This was all you had? <laughs> you should have known when to stay on the bench. I know my limits better than anyone. But still. Mr. Piccolo! Let's go! Hope you're at peace! Be gone! You're less than dirt! You won't survive this time. You won't survive this time. The fun has run out. I'm going to destroy this planet and wipe you all out at once. <sighs> He's wide open. The special beam cannon might work on him now. Over here! Damn it! Forget it. Oh, I'm a great victory for you. You're less than dirt. Be gone! Hell's a grenade! <laughs> There's no escaping me. It was the best I could do. energy. He could actually beat Cell. I don't think so. <clears throat> no good. Their power's evenly matched, so I'd better tip the scale. See you in hell! <laughs> <laughs> It's over? Kohan, you're alive! Yeah, I'm okay. But I was a fool. 
I didn't finish Cell when I had the chance, and now, Dad... No. Don't blame yourself. Even if Goku had been fighting in your place, things likely would have gone the same. You two are so alike, it's hilarious. What you share isn't being naive. It's compassion for even your worst enemies. And it's because of that compassion that I'm still alive to this day. Mr. Piccolo! Gohan, be proud of the man you are. Your kindness isn't a weakness. In fact, it's your greatest strength. Someday, I want to become just as strong as you and Dad, Mr. Piccolo. Will you help me? Wow. You grow up fast, kid. Let's not waste any time. <laughs> 